Hello again, YouTube, and I've got another Lily Put Lane. That's three I've done now on this channel. Um, but this one hasn't been converted yet. So it's still running on batteries, and this one's a slightly unusual one in the fact that the battery compartment's like this. And you turn it on and off with a little push button down here. So we're going to be getting rid of that push button. So I've got batteries in here. And then underneath the battery compartment is where your yeah, lights are. So I'm going to replace these with LEDs to give it a longer life. Um, and then we're also going to put on here a string, a power lead, so that we can power this off a USB plug, so we don't need to have the batteries in there. Um, what I've done, I've wired up a circuit here. So on the existing set, I can't remember the polarity, so I've got a bridge rectifier, so I can fit it anyway around the plug. And then off that, two LEDs, and these are two 70 ohm resistors, all running on 5 volts, which is USB power. So all I've got to do is take this off, stick this on top with the lead that I've made myself, and then I can join the rest of the set. So the uh, battery holder has been removed, and it's down here. It's a normal AAA battery holder. Again, AAA, so that means for filament bulbs, this is going to last about 10 minutes. So I couldn't even use AA. Uh, the board in here is very simple. It's just a little blob circuit, but all it's doing, you've got a little contact switch which is hooked on these two white wires and when they and then you just turn the lights on and off so there's a little transistor here which does the switching if you can see that there a little transistor so this can go in the bin now and all I've got to do is fit that on there and I'll wire the battery up as well so it could run off batteries if they so wish which would have a longer life because batteries obviously LEDs Perfect match. Right, so this is the mess that I've made, and all I've done is hot glued and soldered together that circuit that was on the breadboard. It's now on top of the battery pack. I've bent the LEDs so they'll fit, and I've fitted a connector on the end, which will fit into the rest of the string of uh, these cottages. Cottages? Cottages. Right, and then that, that will fit in the hole, like so. And then the door can close, the wire can come out and go around the bottom somewhere. And it is illuminated. How enlightening. <laughs> anyway, uh, that'll be it for this video. So uh, nice and short one. And uh, I shall see you again. Bye.